God's a promised her. He's going to come again. Amen. And receive us unto himself. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. We're going to sing the song that me and Diane have been singing lately. You thought I was worth saving. Hallelujah. Kia G, Brother Charlie.
know, before we, we dismiss our before we dismiss our, our musicians, before we dismiss you guys, uh, Sister Shauna, can you lead us in prayer request tonight? Yes. Can you do that? Come on, sis. I, I know there's a couple uh, things we need to be praying about tonight. <clears throat> Sister Shauna, keep praying for my mom and uh, also my Uncle Phil's family. They got a lot of uh, decisions they're going to have to be making now with, uh, with my cousin. Uh, they're, where they're going to live. Uh, yeah. Just all kinds of stuff that you have to deal with after uh, you know, your yes. passes away. So let, let's just ask the Lord to just really be with you. Yes. Mariah? Yes, Denise has emphysema and COPD. She got diagnosed with today, so we'll keep praying for her. Yes. Yes, sister. My sister remember our great niece Nicholas. He lives in Kansas. He had two surgeries yesterday. He was born with a rare disease where he has tumors over his body. They're not cancer, but for nine years, his child has been with many, many, many surgeries. But yesterday, he had spine surgery and a trip put in his throat. But his vertebrae and his neck, they collapsed. Oh. So that put pins in and the next month, they're going to have to go and repair those. And he's going to be in a children's hospital in Kansas for six weeks. I'm not going to have a friend that's really close. James and our sister on Eva, his grandma. You know, it's a hard time to see your child lay there and suffer. Yes. And uh, also my aunt Jean, she went to the doctor on Monday and the uh, doctor said that she's not getting any better down here. And, uh, I told yes. my cousin yesterday, I said, you know, doctors can say one thing. <coughs> and I said, but the power of God has to find a word in here. Yes. So I, said, I know what he's done for Brother Brandon, you know, and the kids, you know, different people are known in the years. It's not time to give up. It's time to keep on trusting and trusting God for you. Yes. Okay. Anybody else? I just want to remember being in prayer. I have something going on with my body that the Lord knows all about. Okay. Um, so just keep me in prayer. Yes. Sister Lena. I'm praying for my little uh, great grandson, little Damien. Yeah. Um, he needs a touch in his body. And also, I do feel better, but I still don't feel this. Yes. Yes. Okay. Pray for me. Sister Melrose. Uh, there's a, a lady that lives down by me. I took care of her when she I had her breath. And uh, she's got a, a lady that took supposedly taking care of her and she was busting her out today, but she's not getting no better and she's gonna be turning eighty nine years old. So pray for her that you know she'll get better and this lady will pack off them. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to go to the Lord in prayer now. Lord Jesus, we just ask you to, to touch Sister Melrose's request, Lord, and, um, and um, those that are hurting and suffering, Lord, you know all about it. Lord, I pray for Sister uh, Diane's Aunt Jean, Lord, just touch her and touch the, uh, her body and, and, uh, and her uh, nephew as well. You know all about it.